Welcome back everyone, in today's video, we're diving into the latest developments in the Linux world with a detailed look at Linux Kernel 6.15. Whether you're a developer, system administrator, or a tech enthusiast, this release has some exciting updates and improvements that you won't want to miss. Overview of the release process. Linux Kernel 6.15 is currently in its release candidate phase, with the first RC 6.15 RC1 having been announced by Linus Torvalds. After an active merge window where numerous changes were integrated, the focus now shifts to rigorous testing before the final release, which is expected in late May or early June 2025. This cadence of a two-week merge window followed by a multi-week stabilization period has long been a hallmark of Linux kernel development, ensuring both innovation and stability. Key features and enhancements. Let's break down some of the highlights in this new kernel version. 1. Driver and hardware support. The update includes extensive driver improvements, particularly for AMD and Intel hardware. Enhanced support means better performance on new GPUs and more reliable power management for modern processors. There's also improved compatibility for emerging hardware, such as advanced virtualization features and enhanced support for ARM platforms, including nested virtualization support. 2. File System and I.O. Enhancements Significant improvements have been made to file system performance. For example, there are optimizations in read balancing for RAID setups, as well as enhanced support for uncatched buffered I.O. This is particularly beneficial for systems with fast storage devices, where efficient memory management is key. Other file system updates include new features in XFS and BTRFs that aim to improve reliability and performance in diverse workloads. 3. Performance and scheduler improvements the core kernel has received several optimizations that enhance scheduling and resource management. These improvements help ensure that even as systems scale, performance remains smooth and efficient. Updates to the memory management and MM subsystems also contribute to better system responsiveness under heavy loads. 4. Rust integration and developer focus changes. One of the exciting areas in this release is the further integration of Rust support. With additional Rust abstractions now present, we're starting to see the groundwork laid for future drivers written in Rust a step that promises safer and more maintainable kernel code in the long run. There are also numerous architecture-specific tweaks that improve both stability and performance, showing that Linux continues to push forward with both legacy and emerging hardware in mind. What this means for users and developers. For end users, these improvements translate into a more robust and efficient system, whether you're gaming on Linux, managing servers, or running cutting-edge applications. For developers, the updated kernel presents new opportunities to leverage modern programming languages like Rust, alongside continued support for traditional C-based development, ensuring that Linux remains versatile and future-proof. Conclusion in summary, Linux kernel 6.15 is set to bring a host of driver updates, performance enhancements, and new features that underscore the strength and flexibility of the Linux ecosystem. While it's still in the testing phase as a release candidate, the progress so far points toward a very promising final release. If you're interested in exploring the latest kernel improvements or even testing the RC yourself, you can download it directly from the official Linux kernel archives. As always, keep an eye on updates from your Linux distribution, as they'll integrate these changes once stability is confirmed. Thank you for watching. If you found this overview helpful, please give us a like, subscribe for more in-depth tech updates, and share your thoughts in the comments below.